Hi there, it's Elaine Swan, the Etiquette Lady, here to give you my weekly wrap-up, which is called Oh Behave. I am pointing out folks who have made it into the news to behave themselves and also dishing out a gold star or two as well. Well, this week was really a very physical week for some Oh Behave, and I got the little handy-dandy notebook here, so let me keep it. Greg Gianforte needs to behave. He is an individual out of Montana who is running for a seat, an open seat in the House, this week decided to body slam a reporter who was interviewing him. Uh, that's not good. You never put your hands on anybody, regardless of what it is, unless you're protecting yourself, of course. Uh, he went on to win the next day, unfortunately. Unfortunately, because we don't really need people that are body slamming people representing us. But okay, we'll see how this goes. But oh, behave, Greg Gianforte. Also, who needs to behave this week is... Donald Trump looks to me like he was pushing past and kind of shoved past one of the members, the Prime Minister of Montenegro. Um, this week, I looked at the video several times. The two things I did not see, I did not see eye contact where he kind of connected with the gentleman after kind of pushing past him uh, just to acknowledge his presence, nor did I see any words coming out of his mouth to kind of, in that particular instance to maybe say excuse me or something like that. He pushed past, straightened his coat, puffed out his chest, and to me that looked like something that was very inappropriate and not very proper and, and ungentlemanly. So, oh, behave, Donald Trump, and acknowledge people. That's not good. Also, Danny Mather, Playboy, uh, known for Playboy, last uh, year she s took a picture of a woman in the gym, sent it on Snapchat, and said, if I can't unsee this, then neither can you. And folks didn't like that. That was body shaming because she didn't like the way the woman looked. She later apologized and said it was meant for a friend, which is still improper. Uh, and it goes against what I share as far as social media is concerned. You should always get the person's permission before posting it. Even if you're sending it privately, you know, it shouldn't be something that the person doesn't know about. And we know what she was doing and it was wrong. So this week she was sentenced to community service as well she should. She should serve the community for what she did. Not good, Danny Mathers. Hopefully you do better. And it also sends a message to other people for not doing that. I've got two gold stars this week. One for... Tom Hardy, the actor, he set up a fund for victims and uh, at fam the family members and the victims of the Manchester terrorist attack that took place after the Ariana Grande concert. So good you're using your star power to raise money for families who have suffered this terrible, terrible act. So good for you. And also a gold star to Chapman University who gave a mom a honorary degree. She took her quadriplegic son to school and sat with him in class every day and took notes for him. And so the school gave her a uh, honorary degree. And I work with Chapman University, beautiful, beautiful school, campus, love everyone there. And so I'm, I'm so proud to, uh, that this is what they did. So that's it for this week's wrap up. I'm Elaine Swan, the etiquette lady. I will see you next time.